Well, this is the last box patch. That's the barn finally tidied up. Lots more room in there now. And a bit more room for you, little red tractor. Hi, Stan. What are you doing? I've cleaned out the barn. What's this? That's my granddad. He was a very keen horseman. In fact, he won the Babblebrook Gold Cup three years running. You mean your granddad was a champion? Oh, not really. The Babblebrook Gold Cup was a race around the farms they used to run during the holidays. Granddad used to love it. <laughs> I'll have to find somewhere to hang it. Stan, there's something stuck to the back. What is it? Hmm, it's some kind of a map. It seems to mark a spot right at the end of Five Oaks Field. That's where the old stables used to be. Now, why would he have a map to mark that? It's treasure, I bet. Well, Grandad didn't have much except for Little Red Tractor over there. <laughs> Maybe one of these days I'll have to take a look. Let's look now. It could be treasure, gold and stuff. Don't be silly. It's not treasure. Is it, Stan? Tell you what, I have to deliver some grain to Stumpy's windmill. We'll go and take a look at the weekend. Oh, but I want to go now. Whatever lies there was buried by my grandfather many years ago. I'm sure it will still be there at the weekend. Oh, OK. Come on, Amy. See you later, Stan. See you later, little red tractor. Come on, let's get this grain delivered. But that belongs to Stan. I only borrowed it. I'm going to give it back. It's still stealing. Just borrowing. I don't want to keep anything. We'll just go and take a look and whatever we find, we'll give to him. You know what Stan's like. He'll get all busy and we'll never get to go. Well, it would be an adventure, wouldn't it? OK. Come on, let's go. Oh, sorry. Did we surprise you there, Stumpy? Oh, hello, Stan. <laughs> oh, I'm trying to tweak the engine on Nipper. I'm sure he's running way too fast. Strange thing, Stumpy. I found an old painting of Grandad today on a horse. I think it was the one he used to ride in the Babblebrook Gold Cup. Oh, oh, oh yes. My old dad used to ride in that. Oh, good times, Stan, I can tell you. <laughs> Mind you, your grandfather was the best of the best. <laughs> Whatever happened to the old cup? I thought Grandad won it three times and got to keep it. Oh, there's a story there, all right. Come on, I'll get the kettle on and tell you all about it. <laughs> I thought he might. And three paces this way. Ouch! <laughs> it's not funny, Amy. According to the map, the treasure is buried right... Here. Are you sure? That's what the map says. Come on, let's start digging. So, you see, Gosling Farm was losing a lot of money. And your grandfather was worried he might have to sell everything to keep it going. I knew times were hard for Grandad, so why didn't he sell the cup? Well, he wanted you to inherit the farm. And I'm sure he'd have wanted you to have his gold cup as well. So he buried the cup to save it, so that he could give it to me? <laughs> Thanks, Stumpy. Let's get this grain unloaded, and then I'll go to Five Oaks Field and see what I can find. How about that, little red tractor? We're going on a treasure hunt! I'm bored. Maybe I should have taken bigger steps. Stan's granddad would have had bigger legs than me. And a bigger brain. I've got something! What is it? Help me out! Uh oh! Mr Jones is coming! Help me get out! Well, well, well. What are you up to? Uh, digging for treasure? No, we're not. Aye. You have been busy. 
Hmm, maybe I should call Ryan and Amy. I'm sure they'd hate to miss our treasure hunt. Hey, what's up? You're right. They're already over there. And I can see Big Blue. And Mr Jones, too. Come on, let's go. Are you all right down there? Uh, yes, thank you. May I? That belongs to Stan. Well, it would appear to me that you have been digging in my field, and therefore I believe the, uh, whatever it is, is mine. We found the gold cup for your granddad won. You mean I found it? Well, that's great. It looks a little the worse for wear, though. As a matter of fact, this cup, or whatever it is, was found in my field, so... But it belongs to Stan, doesn't it, Stan? Well, the cup really belonged to my granddad, but I think he meant for me to have it. He won it in the Bubble Brook Gold Cup. Ah, uh, yes, I've heard about that. <laughs> think you could win this cup back, Stan? Stan could win any race easily. But neither of us have a horse. Little Red Tractor could race Big Blue. And the winner keeps the Bubble Brook Gold Cup. Well... OK, you're on. <laughs> Here you are, Stan. It's my lucky hat. I think you're going to need it. <laughs> right. Once round the field, under the tree, through the gates, and then back. OK. Ready? Stan! Ready! Go! Come on, little red tractor, you can do it! Good grief, that was close. Didn't realise the branch was so low. Never mind, Big Blue. We can still catch him. We are bigger and faster. Let's go! I can't see where I'm going. So much for Walter's lucky hat. Sorry, little red tractor. You stopped just in time. Need a lift, Stanley? We're a long way behind, but let's give it our best. Oh, we're too wide to get through, Big Blue. I'll have to open the other gate. Hang on! Careful! We'll never make it! I don't believe it! We're going to get beaten by that old lump of... tin! Don't forget to close the gate after you. Stan and Little Red Tractor are going to win. Oh, 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 quite right too. Oh, his grandfather would be proud. Well done, Little Red Tractor. I knew you could do it. <laughs> I don't know how you did it, Stan. But you and that little red tractor of yours deserve to win. Well done. You may not be big, but you're the best. 